Hey guys, let's see if this guy's gonna give me a kiss. Come on, let's move in. Come here, give me a kiss. Come here, give me a kiss. Give me a kiss, baby. Give me a kiss. <laughs> give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Aqua blue water is all I see. Blue in the sky and it's all so deep. Say island to Boom! Aloha Friday, my Hawaiian peacock. Oh, Hana, this is your boy, Brother Mel, AKA the Hawaiian peacock here with another video for you big shout out to jessica go check out her channels we'll have all the links down in the description below all right it's a better world on her instagram and her youtube page is aqua girl talks i'll have everything down below in the description big shout out to you jessica thanks for referring this place for me to go check out hey see the sign exotic aquarium Ooh, exotic let's go see what all this exotic talk is about never been here before we're gonna go check it out yeah Okay guys, I gotta show you guys when you first walk in what tank you are hit with. It's a huge African cichlid tank. You gotta check out. Every fish in here is pretty big and they're all for sale. Check it out. Check out the African cichlids. This Venusis right here is huge. Now this video doesn't do uh, the size of these fish justice. But these things are huge. Look at this eye by the compressor set. Look at it, he's huge. Look at the colors. Just banging. Banging. Rhodesia. Yellow Jakes. I mean, look at the blood dragon. There's a huge blood dragon in here that's gorgeous right here. Look at this guy. Ooh, wee. Look at this one here. Look at this living stone eye. Look at him. He's massive. Like, this is my hand. Now, let me go back. This is my hand, he's huge. He's gotta be almost as big as my hand. Massive. Beautiful, beautiful fish, check him out. Giant Garami. This looks like Joey's King of DIY. Big shout out to Joey, check him out. This dude's massive. This dude's gotta be like, I don't know, way bigger than my hand, over a foot long. Probably like, if I was to guesstimate, maybe 13, 14 inches. Huge, look at that big peacock bass, guys. I am jonesing on these fish right now. Straight up jonesing. Arowana, massive. Now check this dude out. Guys, look at this peacock bass. This dude is ready to go home. He's about 10 inches, maybe 11 inches. Australian marijuana. Australian marijuana. Check this out. Look at these peacock bass. I wish I could show you guys how big they are. Definitely over a foot long, maybe 15 inches. Watch how aggressive this fish is. Look at them. Watch them. They do not like my hand. Look at him, look at him, ah! Look at him. Ah, jeez, this dude just struck the glass! This dude is gangster, a straight gangster. If I bought this dude right now, I would name him Scarface. A straight gangster. Look at the saltwater reef tank. So colorful. We got it. Tanks on this side. We got supplies on this side. Check out this all Frontosa tank, guys. Beautiful Frontosas. Okay, so I was just informed that these three racks right here, right there, this one, this one, and this one, all African cichlids. So if you're an African cichlid lover, this would probably be the pace. All sizes, huge ones, full grown, medium, tiny, you name it, they got it. Ah. Check out these bad grid shovel nose catfish. Nice little school. Check out these clouded golden archers. These are nice. Okay, check out the koi sword tails. Imagine grabbing a school of those. 
Check out these black spot barbs, man. I've never seen these before. Check out the color. Just school of those look tight. Oh, check these out. Red Bay Snook. Three of them in here. Nice size, about seven, eight inches. And these are Asian red tail catfish. Asian red tail catfish. Look at these dudes. Look how busy these guys are. Zamora catfish. Look at them. Ooh, red tail, red tail. Gucci mama. <laughs> Man, I'm super impressed. These guys got some really unique fish here. Fish that I've never seen before. Exotic. They're keeping their word. <laughs> OMG, check these guys out. Albino geophagus. Look at that. Look at the pectoral fins. Look at the dorsal fin. Look at the color on the anal fin. Check that out. Pretty active fish. Look at that. A bunch of those in a tank look beautiful. Look at those fins. Those fins are fire. Hey, Mr. Gulper. Look at these fat boys. Three of them. Oh my God. Look how big their mouths are. Uh, these things have got to be about eight inches. <laughs> these things are monsters. Talk about Goliaths right here. That mouth and that belly expands to where they can eat a fish bigger than them. All right, man, can anybody tell me what these are? ATFs, baby. African tiger fish. These things will get monster-ish. Look at them. Built for speed. You talk about a predator fish, this is the one right here. ATF, African tiger fish, <laughs> Goliath, right there, 179. These little guys right here are about four inches, three inches, but we'll get to 75 feet. Just kidding, but they'll get big. Look at them, feed me, feed me, feed me, feed me. All right, guys, so check it out. As I'm looking at the koi and the tank, look at these beautiful yellow Udon koi. And they got some butterfly koi here too as well. Check them out. Some more butterfly koi. And then look at the black koi. Now, I don't know if you guys know this about black koi, but if you get a black koi and put it in your pond, it's supposed to bring you good fortune and good luck. So having a black koi in your pond is actually a very, very good thing. And actually to find a black koi, is, it's kind of hard. It's kind of hard. Look at, they just match with the bottom. Black koi, we're thinking about it. Good fortune, good luck. I mean, that's what I need. That's what everybody needs. Everybody should have a black koi. So down in the comments, tell me if I should get a black koi for Tiki Falls 2.0. Big selection of goldfish here, guys. Look at that. They got the Ranchu, they got the Shibokin. Nice colors. Look at this. This is a walk-in. OMGZ. Look at these show Shakaru short tail Ryukin. God, look at them. Look at these dudes. Look at the bellies on these guys. Check it out. Oh my gosh. <laughs> You're jingling, baby. Go ahead, baby. You're jingling, baby. Go ahead, baby. <laughs> Guys, and in the back of the store, this is their salt water selection here. So they got their salt water tanks. And then all of these rows here are all fresh water. All the way down, you can see how far they go down to the very end here. Big selection of fish. Check out these Oranda goldfish. Uh, maybe another Oranda goldfish for uh, Oranda Lagoon in the front. Oh, look at this dude. Oh gosh, I like this dude's color. How unique is that guy? That's a beautiful Oranda. I've never seen an Oranda like that before. 
boom guys check it out i'm sitting here in front of the african cichlid tank getting ready to get out of here this tour has been awesome if you guys like tours like this leave a comment down uh, below okay let me know if you guys like when the hawaiian peacock goes on uh fish or lfs store tours i enjoy it um and so does my wallet too i'm sure but anyways we can't we can't leave here empty-handed we got to get something i just don't know what to get i don't know I've seen so many things I want. I mean, I want one of those guys. I want a bunch of these guys. Uh, the possibilities are endless. So if you're not part of that Hawaiian peacock ohana, subscribe to my channel, guys. And right over there, hit that notification bell, okay? It's going to notify you when I put out a new video. That's all it does, okay? Don't forget to like this video uh, and share, too. Sharing is caring. Caring is sharing comment down below guys we're getting something my boy's getting it bagging it up bagging it up what is it what did the hawaiian peacock get stay tuned boom had a good time guys inside exotic aquarium awesome place here in sacramento california i'll leave the address all that stuff down in the description below they have a facebook page so i will leave that facebook page down in the description come by and check them out another big shout out to jessica thank you so much jess for introducing me to the exotic aquarium had a great time huge store big selection of fish too as well we're on our way home maybe in the backyard maybe inside the house maybe in the front yard to add a new addition to the peacock ohana stay tuned you guys got to see what i picked up we'll see you in the house in one second boom we are home just like i promised guys that whole youtube teleportation stuff home just like that we got the backyard we're in the house right now and we got the front yard so we got curtain number one curtain number two or curtain number three where are we putting a new fish one two three Boom! So those of you that guessed that we're out front in the outdoor water feature, you're right. We picked up a new Oranda goldfish for Oranda Lagoon. Let's check it out. We got all my babies here to come meet and greet me. Or I should say meet and greet us. Here we go, guys. Look at the new addition. Tell me he is not gorgeous. Look at him. He's got like a yellow head, little Dalmatian body, almost kind of pink, white, pearl color. There he goes. Man, that dude is stunning. Look at him. Look at everyone saying hi. Hey, what's up, bud? Hey, welcome. He doesn't look stressed out, cruising around, mingling with everyone. Look at his colors. Look how beautiful Aranda Lagoon is. This guy just sets it off. Let's give him some floating pellets. Oh, look at him. Look at Goldie. Goldie's already eating. I just put him in here. So we already know he's relaxed. He's not stressed. Ah, oh, this dude right here. Love him. Love him, guys. There he is. Look at him. He's looking great, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Aloha Friday to everybody out there. Happy fish, happy life, much love, and aloha. Oh, the water she moves me Every, every day Oh, the water